Hello viewers, welcome to Gadget Docket. Today in this video, let's see how to do online shopping using your mobile phone. There are a number of uh, websites and apps available in India to do online shopping and today the one which we are going to see is the most popular one, the Flipkart. In this video, let's discuss how to do online shopping on Flipkart as well as let's see the things which one should notice before doing online shopping. Before that, if you have not subscribed to our channel, please click the red color subscribe button below. Your subscriptions will help our channel grow and help us make more videos like this. So without any delay, let's get into the video. Flipkart, it's one of the giants in online shopping market in India and uh, the most popular features of Flipkart which I personally like are uh, like in Flipkart. They have categorized all the products so well that you can um, easily search and find the product which you need and similarly they also have a very good uh, return policy so that if you receive a product and you find it uh, to be defective or you find some problems with that you can easily replace it to know all these things first of all we need to download flipkart so let's get into google play store Click on Google Play Store and search for Flipkart F L I P K A R T Flipkart and click search. This is the app. Click and open the app. Well, here you will find an option to download the app. Click on it and download the app. Since I have downloaded it earlier, I don't get that option. I have also given you a direct link to download the app right below in my description section. You may also use that. So once the app is downloaded, let's get back and open the app. If you are a new user you need to give your mobile number and then you need to click sign up so that you will receive a verification password or a code to your mobile number through SMS and you need to enter that verification code or password correctly. Once it is verified you will be allowed to create a password for your account. So every time when you log in in future you need to give this mobile number and your password correctly to get into the app. If uh, you are an existing user you may just click on sign in here and enter your mobile number as I said earlier and your password and then you can get in. Well once you log in this is how the main page of your Flipkart app will look like and here it will show you the latest offers and uh, the newly launched products. If you like something you can go ahead and uh, buy but suppose if you are looking for some specific product you have to come here and click on these three lines. So here Flipkart will show you all the categories of products that they have. Let's say for an example I need to buy a mobile phone. I will go to electronics section and I will select mobiles. So here are the various options of mobile phones available on Flipkart like new launches, only on Flipkart, top selling phones, everything. If suppose I have uh, some specifications in my mind and I need to search a mobile according to those specifications then uh, I need to come to find the right mobile. And this was what I was talking about earlier. Uh, you have a very good uh, option to search a product which you need on Flipkart. So here I will give my options like brand, which brand I need and price. Say for example I go with uh, 10,000 to 18,000 and screen size, battery capacity and the operating system. Definitely I need Android so I select that. Once everything is done I click on apply and search. Well now Flipkart will filter the mobile phones and show those mobiles that will satisfy my specifications or my needs so you can also more uh, add more filters by clicking on this option and add more filters if you have some 
and also you can arrange this list of mobiles in a way which you like for uh, for that you need to go to sort and let me select this option price high to low so the same list will be arranged in such a way that you would like to see so now i look for the mobile phone that will suit me and well i go with this mobile i click on this and i open but before you buy the main things which you need to notice are like the first one the price which everybody will notice you will see whether the price is uh, low and you will compare it with uh, some other shopping websites and this is obvious the second important thing which you need to notice is the EMI suppose if you want to buy the phone on EMI definitely you will need a credit card so click on this option and based on the credit card you have you can check the EMI options available for you to buy this particular mobile phone say for example I have Citibank credit card I will click on this and I can see the options available for me like uh, the number of months the EMI which I need to pay every month and the overall cost which I will be paying at the end of the EMI period the next important thing and the most important thing which you need to notice is the replacement policy here you can see this mobile has a 10 days of replacement which means you buy the mobile phone and you use it and you find something uh, to be a fault in that, in that mobile phone you can return the phone uh, within 10 days and you can claim for a replacement uh, and this replacement uh, policy will vary from a product to product so you need to carefully look into this replacement policy and the next thing you need to notice is the details that is the specifications of the phone to know more you can click here and know the complete specification the last and the most important thing which you need to notice is the ratings and the review here the people those who have used the phone earlier would have given their reviews about the phone so you read them at least one or two and then if you feel satisfied click on buy now so now you are asked to give your address the address of delivery you need to enter the details correctly and then click save once you confirm the address you will be taken to this page where you can um, verify your order details like the address of delivery uh, the name of the product the price and uh, the approximate date of delivery everything once you verify all these details click on continue and now you will be taken to the payments page and here I have already added my credit cards and debit cards to this account to pay uh, to make payments so those details are shown here likewise you can also add your uh, credit or debit card and make payments using them uh, for that click on this option uh, to know how to make payments online using credit cards and debit cards we have already made a video you can find those links in our description section below you have also got uh, many other options of payment like net banking and EMI installments uh, the last one is the cash on delivery COD option in that case if you select uh, cash on delivery you need to pay the cash only when you get your product delivered at your uh, location you can hand over the cash to the person who delivers you the product so once this is done you can click continue so that your order will be placed and to confirm that you will receive a SMS uh, to your registered mobile number as well as an email uh, to the mail ID which you have given so that's it you can now shop online I hope this video is very useful and helpful if you like this video please give us a thumbs up and to watch more videos like this please subscribe to our channel thank you and bye bye